Stellar sea lion is the largest sea lion, it has attracted considerable attention in recent decades owing to significant, unexplained declines in their numbers over a large portion of their range in Alaska. They were hunted for meat and other commodities by prehistoric communities everywhere their range intersected with human communities. The South American sea lion is perhaps the archetypal sea lion in appearance. Males have a very large head with a well-developed mane, making them the most lionesque of the eared seals. The movement ecology of South American sea lions remains poorly understood, although biologging studies in recent years have advanced our understanding of their at-sea movements at some breeding locations. Otoreids have proportionately much larger foreflippers and pectoral muscles than phocids, and have the ability to turn their hind limbs forward and walk on all fours, making them far more maneuverable on land. Japanese sea lion generally bred on sandy beaches which were open and flat, but sometimes in rocky areas. They were hunted commercially in the 1900s, leading to their extinction, but there are efforts to reintroduce sea lions to the Sea of Japan. California sea lions are particularly intelligent, can be trained to perform various tasks and display limited fear of humans if accustomed to them. Because of this, California sea lions are a popular choice for public display in zoos. They have demonstrated the ability to understand simple syntax and commands when taught an artificial sign language. However, the sea lions rarely use the signs semantically or logically. Amegoteria is an example of a primitive walrus that does not grossly appear similar to a modern walrus. The teeth of Amegoteria indicate that its feeding ecology was markedly different from that of modern walrus, and more similar to that of less specialized pinnipeds like seals. Gomphoteria had four tusks and is a prime example of the extreme diversity that walruses once exhibited. From fossil records Ivacus was at least as big as, if not slightly bigger than, the modern walrus, and like the modern walrus, was probably a molluscivore. Walruses live mostly in shallow waters above the continental shelves, spending significant amounts of their lives on the sea ice looking for benthic bivalve mollusks to eat. Walruses are relatively long-lived, social animals, and they are considered to be a keystone species in the Arctic marine regions. Red panda has been previously placed in the raccoon and bear families, but the results of phylogenetic analysis provide strong support for its taxonomic classification in its own family. Red pandas are excellent climbers and forage largely in trees. They eat mostly bamboo but sometimes eat small mammals and eggs. Like the giant panda, they cannot digest cellulose, so they must consume a large volume of bamboo to survive. Striped skunk is a polygamous omnivore with few natural predators, save for birds of prey. It has a long history of association with humans, having been trapped and captively bred for its fur and kept as an exotic pet. It possesses two highly developed scent glands, one on each side of the anus, which provides a chemical defense against predation. The musk consists of a mixture of powerfully odorous thiols which can be sprayed at a distance of several meters. The striped polecat is an aggressive and very territorial animal. It marks its territory with its feces and through an anal spray. The spray serves as a defense against predators, in a similar manner as employed by skunks. Though related to raccoons and coatis, Chapalmelania was a large creature, it probably resembled the giant panda. Due to its size, its remains were initially identified as those of a bear. 
The original habitats of the raccoon are deciduous and mixed forests, but due to their adaptability they have extended their range to mountainous areas, coastal marshes and urban areas, where some homeowners consider them to be pests. They then often pick up the food item with their front paws to examine it and rub the item, sometimes to remove unwanted parts. This gives the appearance of the raccoon washing the food. Kinkajous spend most of their life in trees, to which they are particularly well adapted. They are hunted for the pet trade, for their fur and for their meat. While they are usually solitary when foraging, they occasionally forage in small groups. It evolved in Central America and invaded the formerly isolated continent of South America several million years ago, as part of the Great American Interchange, when formation of the Isthmus of Panama made it possible to do so. The European polecat is the sole ancestor of the ferret, which was domesticated more than 2,000 years ago for the purpose of hunting vermin. The species has otherwise been historically viewed negatively by humans. It has a more compact body than other mustelid, a more powerfully built skull and dentition, it is less agile and it is well known for having the characteristic ability to secrete a particularly foul-smelling liquid to mark its territory. Asian small clawed otters are mostly social animals, it lives in extended family groups with only the alpha pair breeding, offspring from previous years help to raise the young. It is the smallest otter species in the world. Its paws are a distinctive feature, its claws do not extend beyond the fleshy end pads of its partially webbed fingers and toes. This gives it a high degree of manual dexterity so that it can use its paws to feed on mollusks and crabs. The sea otter inhabits nearshore environments, where it dives to the sea floor to forage. It preys mostly on marine invertebrates such as sea urchins. Unlike most marine mammals, the sea otter's primary form of insulation is an exceptionally thick coat of fur, the densest in the animal kingdom. Although it can walk on land, the sea otter is capable of living exclusively in the ocean. Its use of rocks to dislodge prey and to open shells makes it one of the few mammal species to use tools. Similar to other badgers, the Japanese badger's diet is omnivorous, these badgers are found in a variety of woodland and forest habitats. Japanese badgers are nocturnal and hibernate during the coldest months of the year. A solitary animal, wolverine has a reputation for ferocity and strength out of proportion to its size, with the documented ability to kill prey many times larger than itself. It may defend kills against larger or more numerous predators such as wolves or bears. It is a stocky and muscular carnivore, more closely resembling a small bear than other mustelid. Eurasian wolverines are claimed to be larger and heavier than North American. Honey badger is primarily a carnivorous species and has few natural predators because of its thick skin and ferocious defensive abilities. They have been known to savagely and fearlessly attack almost any kind of animal when escape is impossible, reportedly even repelling much larger predators such as lions. Bee stings, porcupine quills, and animal bites rarely penetrate their skin. If cape buffaloes intrude upon a rattle's burrow, it will attack them. They are intelligent animals and are one of a few species known to be capable of using tools. <laughs>